Hi, Nick Granville here from Wellington, New Zealand. I just got this new guitar. It's an Ibanez AR420. Beautiful top to it, lovely instrument. Um, just thought I'd do a quick demo of it um, for those that are interested in this instrument. Uh, I've had it for maybe a week now, maybe a week and a half. Um, one of the first things I love about this guitar is it has this awesome switching system. So you have you can have them in full humbucker of the pickups and you can switch it up to single coil and then up to parallel rather than series of the two coils. So you have lots and lots of different tones. So I'll just go through a couple of those sounds. So this is neck pickup, full humbucker, just with a lead straight into my little Victoria amp here. No pedals, nothing, just straight in. So this is the neck pickup. <laughs> See in here it's lovely and warm sounding and then if I flick the switch up I'm in neck pickup single chord. And then up again and I'm in parallel so the two chords are in parallel. And then you have the next setting, which is both pickups on, and I have them both in full humbucker. And then both pickups on and single call. So you can hear it's brighter with the volume drop. I actually quite like the volume drop because um, it means that I can play more rhythm parts and bury them into the band rather than having them jumping out and then switch down quickly and have a full humbucker sound with a slight increase in volume which is good for soloing because it just gives it a boost to jump over the top of the band. And then you have parallel of the mid position. <laughs> Bridge pickup, so this is the bridge pickup in full humbucker mode. Bridge pickup in single coil. And bridge pickup in parallel. I was really surprised with this guitar. I thought I would really dig the humbucker and the single core and I didn't think I'd use the parallel at all, but I actually use it quite a bit. It's like a brighter version of a humbucker, but not quite a single coil. Um, and also with single coils, typically you get hum, whereas parallel humbuckers, you, you, there's no hum, it's dead quiet. In fact, it's probably, more, uh, it's probably quieter than, than having it in series. So, um, The other thing too, I should say, is when you're in the middle setting and you've got both pickups on, you can actually have one pickup out in, in, in parallel and one pickup in series humbucker, or you can have one pickup single coil and one pickup humbucker. <laughs> It all makes a difference and it makes a difference which pickup you do so I'll do it the other way around now. And any combination in between. So that's just there and there. I haven't even touched the volume controls. I haven't touched the amp yet. That's just straight in with this guitar. Um, so as you can see it's got a flame maple top which is lovely with two humbuckers. Uh, it has a glued in neck not a uh, plate or, or bolt in next, so you get a bit more sustain out of that. And it has a big chunky bit right here, which is where guitars sometimes get broken. So that makes that a bit more solid, but it's a maple neck anyway, so it's less likely to break, I think. Um, what else is there about it? Um, it's got quite a big neck. 
it's not a thin neck. I don't really like the thin necks. I like a bit of weight behind the neck, um, you know, a bit of chunk to it, like a Les Paul or something. Um, super versatile guitar. It's a nice weight. Some of these, when they first came out, the originals were very, very heavy. This one here is a nice weight. So it's a very usable guitar. So thanks for watching. Uh, remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel and look me up on Facebook and so on. And um, yeah, cheers, Nick Granville. Thanks. Bye.